Hello, I am Gary Brantner of Red and Arb Studios Comics, and this is my review show, where I talk about some of the comics that I have read, and uh, usually I used to post these on Twitter or Facebook, but now I'm making videos of the reviews. So first up is a uh, Infinite Punishment Shadows of War, uh, issue 2 and 3. Uh, I decided to put those together in one review because I just got these from the, my local comic shop, Gamers Asylum, in Ogden, Utah. And uh, these kind of have a sad note on them. Uh, first off, I, I found these comics by following a Marcelo Trom on Twitter, and thanks to his postings of the comic, I added them to my hold at Gamers Asylum, Utah. And uh, I found out after reading the first issue that uh, Marcelo had passed away. Uh, I think that was in December. And uh, so issue three came out after he passed away. And uh, they they left uh, the, ish the pages penciled but not inked and just lettered over his pencils because they thought that'd be a nice tribute to uh, Marcelo afterwards. Uh, these stories are about these comics are about a, uh, a demon that escapes from hell and uh, comes into our world. Um, they were pretty good, kind of fun, uh, drawn in a uh, oh, what is this style? Um, in a fairly odd parents kind of style. Uh, it's very cartoony and sexualized, but it was a fun little story to read. And you can get you can order those through your comic shop. Uh, just ask for Infinite Punishment, Shadows of War, and they're a three issue series. Next up on my review is a book called. Touching Evil by Dan Doherty, uh, known as Beardo on uh, Twitter. I found these comic books through Twitter and ended up backing them on. It is a very hard cover comic. I backed it on Kickstarter. And uh, it is a story about a lawyer who gets the curse of uh, whoever she touches and is evil, they will die right there on the spot. And uh, their spirit is stuck in a limbo inside her mind. Um, it's a very, 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 very good story. And uh, I'm glad I had read it. It's in the vein of uh, Dean Koontz. I've been a Dean Koontz reader since I was a kid. And, uh, yeah. Yeah. Very good stuff. Um, very strong illustration style and very good storytelling. The storytelling is seriously right up there with Dean Koontz. Um, so check out uh, Touching Evil. Find Dan Doherty. Uh, his Beardo comics are hilarious too. They're kind of uh, an autobiography about... Uh, how he uh, worked at a comic coffee shop and uh, how he meets his spouse and very interesting stuff but that's how I discovered him and uh, got clued into this comic book very good stuff and uh, I have issue or I have the second volume hardcover in my uh, read pile right now well that is uh Ooh, okay, uh, that is all I have to uh, review for right now, and uh, thank you for watching. And uh, don't forget that Rent Narb Studios enamel pins are on Kickstarter and Indiegogo right now. Uh, you can back those to get a pin, and uh, you can get my comic books along with them if you have not had a chance to get those. Um, thanks for watching. Bye.